We have here with us our chef Radha Krishnan sir who's going to show us the recipes and a dessert for heart disease. The ingredients for steamed brown rice and broken wheat with vegetables are brown rice 200 grams, broken wheat 100 grams, broccoli 50 grams, mushroom 50 grams, carrot 50 grams, peas 50 grams, garlic 50 grams, garlic sauce, 50 ml, corn, 50 grams, brown rice, 200 grams, broken wheat, 100 grams, broccoli, 50 grams, mushroom, 50 grams, carrot, 50 grams, peas, 50 grams, garlic, 50 grams, garlic sauce, 50 ml, corn, 50 grams. So now let's look into the recipe and the preparation. Okay, to begin with, we've boiled brown rice and broken wheat. And we take the stew of the brown rice and the broken wheat and boil. The only stew. Beans. We add chopped beans to the stew, corn, Mushroom. mushrooms, garlic. garlic, chopped garlic, Carrot. carrots, finely chopped. Green peas, wholesome, and, broccoli. and grated broccoli. All of these vegetables will cook in the stew. So we boil the vegetables in the stew. So the flavor of the boiled brown rice and the broken wheat will also boil along with the vegetables. So now all the boiled vegetables are boiling in the stew. So they're going to have the flavor of the boiled brown rice and the broken wheat also. So they're going to cook in the stew and give a different aroma. And we're waiting for the vegetables to get cooked. I guess that should be done in a minute or two. If you feel the water consistency is not enough, add some water. Every dish is simple, it's just 10 minutes, it's like that. Okay, so the vegetables are done. Now we add uh, the broken wheat and we stir and we let the broken wheat boil some more. The broken wheat and all the vegetables are getting cooked in the stew. Now we add the boiled brown rice and we let that also cook. This is one dish I guess which is just purely healthy because there's nothing extra added in it. It's just your vegetables and brown rice and broken wheat. So how much more long for mm. it to get cooked sir? Mm. Another two water three minutes? Okay we wait for all the water to drain out. We wait for it to get cooked that much so that all the vegetables can absorb the stew. 
and that should take another five minutes or so. Wait for the entire water to drain out. So finally, I think the steamed brown rice and broken wheat with vegetables is almost done. We shall now transfer it onto a bowl. Remember, it doesn't have any kind of added flavor. No sugar, no salt, no chilies. Brown rice and broken wheat with vegetables is ready. Steamed brown rice and broken wheat with vegetables. This is a very healthy combination of your wheat and a brown rice product. Brown rice is healthy because it is rich in the different nutrients that are attached to the fiber content. So it's rich in fiber, it is rich in these specific nutrients which are helpful in the utilization of the carbohydrates in the diet. Over and above that, there are a lot of vegetables like mushrooms and broccoli and garlic in the diet. All the vegetables that are used are high in fiber. The wheat that is used is high in fiber. And the rice itself that is used is high in fiber. So compared to normal steamed rice with vegetables, this is a very interesting, very different and a very tasty variation. It is high in fiber and any nutrient value that you are looking at it is rich in because it is it has a different colored vegetables added to it it has a hypercholesterolemic effect because of the garlic in it it has a hypercholesterolemic effect that is cholesterol lowering effect because of the fiber content in the vegetables and the fiber content that is coming from whole wheat and brown rice it's a complete meal in itself can be had as an instant lunch or a dinner and is quite wholesome and filling for a, for one single serving it's rich in antioxidants uh, which are coming from the dark colored vegetables like tomatoes, uh, mushrooms, broccoli that are added into it. it it's a rich source of um, antioxidant also. Steamed brown rice and broken wheat along with mushrooms and garlic, wash, peel and cut the vegetables to small pieces and steam in the upper compartment of the cooker or steamer. When both are cooked, mix them together in low heat along with garlic sauce. Cook for 2 minutes and remove from flame. Serve hot.